the update today. I'm going shopping because I have no more clothes. This is it. Infamous coffee and tea mix. So we cousin on this tiny, tiny street. You have to watch out for cars. So I have my Yang Wang. I probably said that wrong, but it's coffee and tea mixed together. And now we're going to have a little walk down the street that comes just off it, which is really nice. Lots of fresh fruit and vegetables. Ooh. Quite exciting to be here because it's very higgledy piggledy and I love it. Street me, it's the only me I know. Street me. So we're about to use cyanide pill. So we're now in the HSBC building, which was designed by Norman Foster, did you say? Sir Norman. Sir Norman. Oh, so it's designed with people in mind, so you've got the lobby which you can just walk through. So it's private and public mixed together. So you get people that can just walk through, and then you've got all the stuff that's happening up above you. So you're not disrupting anyone below, which is really cool. Another tidbit. Another tidbit from Sam and the Lonely Planet Guide. Uh, when it was completed in 1985, it was the world's most expensive building, costing over one billion US dollars. The more you know. Look at the line. I feel like I'm going up by one of those tractor beams into a spaceship. Oh, that's cool. I'm guessing that slides along and then blocks the whole thing off. Oh, it's a nice breeze when you get inside. Ooh, spaceship. It's like a Tron building. I feel like I'm in Tron. Plants and everything. I'm telling you, we're staying in Jurassic World. Velociraptors! <laughs> Clever girl. When we first arrived, we saw people doing yoga on this area, but I don't know if that's a regular thing because I haven't seen it since. Very 
staircase Where does it go? Probably down to the T-Rex paddock Because I'm obsessed with the fact that this place is Jurassic World And it is That's where the T-Rex lives It's his kingdom now We're all gonna get eaten Remember, if something chases you, run! London statue, with the waterfall. It makes me need to pee, but let's face it, when do I not need to pee? Like all the time. Now it's really slippy, so I'm probably going to fall, but ooh, I'm dizzy now. Ooh. The rounded garden. Makes sense. It's my tiny snail friend, Claude. Come on, Claude, you can do it. Go, Claude, go, Claude, go, Claude, go, Claude, yay, Claude. I am not fast. Very speed now long though. Yo Claude, I have no idea where he's going, but I hope he does. Do any of us know where we're going? This stuff is deep.